My focus is really trying to understand what is going on in the brain of people who are at risk for Alzheimer's disease. We have made great advances in heart disease, cancer, where we've actually been able to reduce the number of deaths associated with these diseases, but not with Alzheimer's disease. Alzheimer's disease is perhaps one of the biggest problems we face today. The odds are about one in three if we reach the age of 85 years. Currently in the U.S., there's five million people living with Alzheimer's disease. These numbers will triple by the year 2050. Now we can actually use brain imaging to view the Alzheimer's pathology in the living human brain. 